So this question says, store W's total expenses for selling and installing four tires is $100. Let's just write that down. Expenses equals $100. The next sentence says, which function represents the profit, P of A, so profit is P of A, in dollars from selling and installing four tires to which the store's discount is applied. And then we have parentheses. It looks like they're going to tell us how to find the answer here. It says profit is equal to, so P of A is equal to total amount of money received. So I'll just say money in minus expenses. So minus expenses. Okay. So how much money is coming in? if someone is buying and installing four tires. Well, for store W, the list price per tire is $8. So I can say, well, that should be four times A, okay? Then when I get to the discount side, it says if you buy three tires at list price, you get the fourth tire free. So that tells me that they're not actually getting four times A, they're just getting three times A, right? Because that fourth tire is free. You're not paying for that fourth tire. So that takes care of the discount. And then the installation fee is $50 for all five tires. So they're also going to get in 50 bucks, right? So a person comes in, they're going to pay three times a dollars for three tires, get one tire free to make it four tires, but then they're going to also pay $50 to install all four tires, right? So that's the money in. And then I want to subtract from that the expenses, which we were told in the question, the expenses are 100, so just minus 100. So there's my equation, P of A, equals 3a plus 50 minus 100. When I simplify this, I have 50 minus 100, which is negative 50. So this turns into p of a equals 3a minus 50. And therefore, the correct answer here is choice B.